A new vaccine clinic opened in Batavia today, but county data shows only a small number of people who booked an appointment there actually live in the area. The Genesee Health Department says more than 47% of the people who will get a vaccine at the Batavia site are from Erie County. That is almost three times the amount from Genesee County. Olivia Proya looks into why some clinics are more restrictive than others. City people are put ahead of us country people, and that's not right. We should all be equal. Health officials say only about 25% of the vaccine appointments booked in Batavia went to people from Genesee, Orleans, and Wyoming counties. We're happy that New Yorkers are able to get the vaccine. Doesn't matter where you get it. But this was supposedly for rural counties that were lagging behind in the percentage of people that have been able to get the vaccine. Senator George Borello says he thinks the same thing happened at the state run site in Olean. He says rural counties need restricted vaccination sites like the state FEMA site in Buffalo. They're uh, unfairly uh, restricting uh, major vaccine sites like the one in Buffalo that had 14,000 doses to only certain zip codes while leaving the rural areas with much smaller dose availability uh, wide open to anyone in the state. That's not right that they can still come to our place and take up places and we can't go to theirs. Kathy Hedrich of Randolph says access to the vaccine is not the only issue. She says she cannot make an appointment because she does not have internet access. I don't know. There seems like there should be something they can do for those of us older people who do not have computers and do not have email. It, it's not, it's awful. You know, am I just not going to be able to get a vaccination? Borello says this is an example of how the vaccine rollout is leaving some people out of the loop. In our rural areas, Areas where they are truly underserved, where people don't have broadband, where there is no public transportation, where there are no vaccine sites close by, he doesn't consider that to be underserved. The state health department says non-FEMA vaccination sites are open to all New Yorkers. They did not answer our specific questions about how they will serve people in rural areas. Olivia Proya, 7 Eyewitness News.